whoa, whoa. Before this video even begins, I notice most of my viewers aren't even subscribed. So what are you doing? Hit that subscribe button, ring the bell to get notified about my latest videos, and also smash the like button for good measure. Anyway, enjoy the video. Will this country feel a little sentimental? Or is it another case of discotheque? Well, let's find out together. Roll titles. <laughs> Good afternoon even everybody, I am Jamie Chu, welcome back to a brand new video where once again I react, well slash we, as in me and my, day, my mate Damo, react to another entry in this year's Eurovision Song Contest. This time around it is the turn of Molika Linkite, who, least we forget, was part of the duo act for the 2015 Lithuanian entry, uh, with, but this time she's all on her own little trot in the form of Stay. So yeah, uh, naturally you're going to be seeing the actual reaction from when me and Damon did the live stream literally at the time of recording the night before but it is what it is but nevertheless I'm gonna I've heard it obviously a few more times since then so I'm gonna give you my proper thoughts after it but uh, in the meantime nevertheless you're gonna be seeing me and Damon's reaction so if you've already seen it probably you might want to skip towards the end but if you haven't seen it then I check I would highly recommend to check it out I mean it's interesting anyways nevertheless enjoy me and Damon's reaction to Lithuania Anyway, final song for the national final of Lithuania. Monica Likent. Lik Link it. Link it, thanks. Mm. With Stay. Ooh, piano. The hell's that outfit? Mm. Oh, the backing vocalist. Interesting start. I'm not gonna lie, it's quite eye opening and ear opening. She's very golden, isn't she? Have a dodgy camera work there. Oh, here we come, the backing vocalists. And she does it as like Leslie Roy from two years ago, doesn't she? Hmm. Who are you messaging? Oh, just a uh, um, comment. On the... Comment on the Publix. Hmm. Seven people watching at the same time, thank you. This is the final song for Lithuania. Well, Lithuania National Final. I'm not keen on the dress. Yeah, it's very goldeny orange. Yeah. Don't be nosy, Jamie. <laughs> Again, it's another mare, isn't it? Hmm. I just feel this is, this is trying to um, appeal to the everybody person, yeah. if you know what I'm saying. That's just how I see it. Mm. This kind of reminds me of Sweden 2021, does it not? You paying attention, dude? Yes, I am. I'm fine to remiss it. <laughs> In other words, he's not paying attention. <laughs> it's just uh, another thing. Don't think Lithuania will qualify this year, in my opinion. 2020 would have been Lithuania's first win in Eurovision since its debut. No. We think it would have been Iceland. No, it would have been Iceland or Italy. We would... Mm, I say Iceland. Yeah, I think Iceland. Lithuania would have with a shout, not going to lie. But well, we still think it would have been Iceland. Well, to be honest, I weren't really a keyed on on fire. I found it very, like, creepy and... Ugh. It was a shame for many countries, 2020. Amen. Yeah. Amen. And, and for never, many artists. We'll probably never ever know who would have won that. Nope. Hmm. Well, we want to keep it as secret as he possibly can. Mm. Yeah, that was another mare, wasn't it? Yes, it was, <laughs> yeah. Now let's get the main thing over and done with, as far as like whether it's a good song or a bad song. Oh look, it's not a bad song whatsoever. Let's just start off with the fact that obviously she is a very good singer, like probably one of the better singers you'll hear, especially with her when she goes high in all of the choruses and certainly towards the end. Just, she, I get the passion, she looks good in the, it's, the outfit is a bit questionable, but yeah, as far as the song itself, it starts off nice with the nice little piano, oh yeah, and everything. But as far as like one other song was concerned in the national final itself, I preferred it when it was just piano and artist only. But this one obviously introduces all of the other instruments. So it's do, 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 do. I mean, it's a fairly good beat, and it keeps you engaged a little bit. I think the choice of backing vocalists are very interesting, as in very progressive, very um for everybody if you like i just think that the son itself especially when they uh when they say that particular word which is suto tuto which i think translates as it's too loud or too loud blame google if i get that wrong i just think it as it drags on uh, towards the rest of the song the fairly catchiness of it all when you get a little bit hooked in the chorus the fact that they keep repeating the same word shuto tuto and just stay my heart is beating all the rest of it it does get samey and repetitive after a little while 
which is a big shame if you ask me, because I think it could perhaps have been a good song uh, if they mixed it up a little bit, but the fact they kept it the same, I don't know. I just think it will be one of those songs that's a little bit disappointing, a little bit lost, and least we forget when we actually saw the national final there were some better songs on the night uh i just think it's going to be a, i think given the fact that the last few years lithuania have sent some really good songs in especially with the roop and last year's one with a bit of monica lou um actually we're going from one monica to another monica this year but i don't know it just for me it just sounds disappointing and in the case of a lot of songs that i find just middle of the road it's meh all the way this is another mare song. Do I see it qualifying right now? No, but that doesn't mean to say given, you know, the rest of the competition that might come out later on, it might progress. It does depend, of course, on the running order they might scrape through, but right now I really do not see this qualifying, which is a big shame because they could have come up with something better than this in the national final, which they were. I think Monica's been given a bit of a dud. Sorry, I don't see this progressing. Anyway, that about this for this particular video, but never mind what I think, or indeed my mate Damo thought of it, because he really doesn't like it. Please do let me know what you think in the comments. Do you think perhaps Lithuania is a very good belter of a son and could qualify and even do really well? Or is it perhaps another mere boring song for you? Uh, let me know your thoughts. Otherwise, you know the drill by now. Subscribe for more of my Eurovision Juicy goodness. Smash the like button for good measure. And of course, ring the bell again out of my latest videos. Catch you again in the next one. Bye-bye, everybody. Bye-bye.